And thus, for the past 300 million years, amniotes have dominated many ecosystems throughout uh, the Earth, not only on land, but also in the air and in the seas as well. They have produced the dominant uh, terrestrial vertebrates alive today in the mammals, birds, and reptiles, all equally descended from the first amniotes. And the grouping of uh, the amniotes and their evolution has been marked by the mass extinctions, such as that at the end of the Devonian, which perhaps gave, uh, helped give rise to the first amniotes, the mass extinction at the end of the Permian, which wiped out many of the anapsid and synapsid groups in the aftermath of which the diapsid reptiles thrived, the mass extinction at the end of the Triassic, after which the dinosaurs thrived after many other archosaur groups became extinct, and the mass extinction at the end of the Cretaceous, after which many dominant reptile groups uh, became extinct, and then birds and mammals would dominate after.